Drone racing is a new type of sport. Just like Formula One or NASCAR, vehicles race against each other at high speeds, trying to avoid one another while weaving through twists and turns. But these are flying robots cruising around in midair, and they're doing it at speeds of up to 90 miles an hour. Drone racing is this new sport. It's very exciting. It only emerged about 18 months ago. It involves when people take drones and they put cameras on them, and those cameras give a video feed to goggles. So you fly the drone to what we call first-person view. It's like sitting in the cockpit of the drone. We invite the best pilots, we go in the most exciting venues, and we have fantastic robot racing. When you wear video goggles and you have a camera on the drone and you're flying at, at speed, you begin to get really immersed. The way the Drone Racing League does it Drone racing is also a brand new type of spectator sport. The viewing experience for the audience is actually even better than the experience for the pilots. These drones are bright, they're moving quickly, they're loud. It's a bit like being in a NASCAR course. But then they have the added advantage that they can also pull on the goggles and they can see a feed off of drone. We're able to transmit video feed live in real time. We just want to make sure it's as exciting to watch as it is to pilot. And so for the audience, they can experience any aspect of the race just by choosing which viewpoint they want to see it from. Forget packed stadiums or even watching these races in person. This sport is all about immersive at-home viewing on TV, on the web, or on a VR headset. The Drone Racing League sees itself not only as a professional sports league, but also as a video production company. So the new drones are DRL. They're made to be in front of a camera. The camera technology that's used in the drones is also just at its earliest phases, and it's adapted from other industries. You can easily imagine three-dimensional cameras having two lenses to give both the pilot and the audience a 3D view of the course that's coming at them. The next year is destined to be a big one for the Drone Racing League. They plan to hold six races in 2016 across the United States. The drones aren't the only thing the league builds from scratch, they also design new courses for each event with vertical hairpin turns, tight squeezes, and other surprises. Every time we go out to race, we can be in some place exciting. And this is a new sport that's wrapped in new technology. It makes you realize how close to the future we are. So how do you watch these races? The league says it will make these videos available on their website, but just like any other sports league, they're also pursuing distribution deals. Expect to see more of this immersive emerging sport in the new year.